worship other gods that he will then send us into slavery because if you so let's talk about slavery okay go watch her video and then come back to this video so yes the reason why god allowed his chosen people aka the israelites aka black african people to go into slavery is because of constant rebellion remember in deuteronomy when the lord said i am taking you to the land that i promised your ancestors but there are nations surrounding that land that are into paganism that worship idols that are into witchcraft that do detestable things do not do what they are doing okay in isaiah if we read further the lord constantly warned them that israel's disobedience and Israel's rejection of him and Israel's rebellion they are cursing themselves they are cursing their children when they are into idol worship and paganism and witchcraft and sacrificing their children and orgies and all this filth from Satan they are cursing themselves and as we know you can choose the choice or the sin but you cannot choose the consequence that follows that sin and that is exactly what happened god warned them over and over turn away from your evil and turn back to me and israel refused so what happened they were scattered among other nations as slaves they were completely decimated okay same thing is happening today the very same thing the fastest growing quote unquote religion among african american women in the united states of america is witchcraft they believe that they are worshiping the gods that their ancestors used to worship the african deities like oshan and osiris and all these demons that Beyonce is telling them to worship it is the same thing you make the choice if you want to sin but you cannot choose the consequence of that sin because that consequence is part of the rule that God made so yes the Lord allowed the Israelites to go through slavery because of constant rebellion okay they were his chosen people. We are his chosen people. Yes, I qualify to speak on this because I am African, South African to be exact. The Lord allows you to face the consequences of your decision. And this seals the fact that Christianity is not a white man's religion.